Getting very wise, I see. Remembering my abilities as an extemporaneous speaker, I've decided to write my speech. We're here today to celebrate the birth of a very special person. 
She goes by many names, some of which are Minnie, Aunt Minnie, Mindel, Mom, and others. My mom has had an extraordinary life and hopefully will continue to do so for a long time to come. She is indeed a person that wears many hats and does so with grace and aplomb. Minnie is a great mother, a skilled beautician, a good friend, a linguist, humorous, card player, bingo lady extraordinaire, <laughs> businesswoman, beat robber when necessary, and a forger of prescriptions as needed, <laughs> good cook and philanthropist to the extent possible. Minnie's life was full and is full of adventure, hair raising, and not to do with her cutting. She comes from a large family which was very much affected by the Second World War and married to Irwin who also lost most of his family to the same. My parents and I went through some adventures which ultimately led to a boat ride in a small town in Pennsylvania, the Keystone. The next move was Pittsburgh and a life to fulfill the American dream. Many of you in this room today are here because of the F with us today. I must also mention how proud as we all are at the accomplishments of our family. And you all know who you are. Um, I've got a lot of stories, but the one that's always amused me is my parents, Brenda and her family and I, we're in line to buy tickets to visit Ellis Island when it was refurbished. And I told my mother that I had contributed some money and we had a plaque in Ellis Island. At which point she turned to me and said, we didn't come through Ellis Island. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, we had done all our immigration work in Hamburg, Germany. And when we came here, we got right on the train in New York and went to the That's Christmas what we did the same thing. My father's birthday is not in December, but in September. You want to I No, that's, that was the next question. This is my father's stuff, so I do Um. I've taken enough of your time. I just want to say happy birthday, Mom, Leon, Judith, and we celebrate your life. So, yeah. the strips you can get the from the place. Well, that's all I have to hear. You'll see the nice lady who tries to describe. It's not easy. I made sure I found out the strips and I cut out the strips size. I gave them the prescription box. And in the, in the doctor's office, was a lady at least. She wrote whatever she wanted to do. And she put a stamp. So, when I hear, because that's all that I want to bring out, when I came here and my son became a lawyer, I showed him the first of his picture. Give me one more blank. Let me show off my son's picture. He said, no, Mom, I cannot trust you. You're going to write this picture. I'm going to sell it.